Durst first came to media attention when his wife, Kathleen McCormick, mysteriously disappeared following an argument the two had on January 31, 1982. Then, in 2000, police planned on interviewing Durst's longtime friend Susan Berman to ask her about the disappearance of McCormick. But before they could do so, Berman was found shot dead, execution style, in her home after police received an anonymous letter directing them to her body. Later, in the documentary filmed by HBO, Durst confessed he wrote the address on the envelope, but says he did not send the note to police. In September 2001, body parts belonging to Durst's neighbor, Morris Black, surfaced in plastic garbage bags in Galveston Bay, Texas, along with a saw and a carving knife. Durst, who had disguised himself as a mute woman, was arrested after police found Black's blood and more garbage bags in his apartment. However, Durst skipped bail and remained on the run for six weeks until police arrested him for shoplifting in Pennsylvania. Police found two loaded guns, marijuana, almost $40,000 in cash, and Morris Black's driver's license in Durst's rental car. Durst confessed to killing Black, but was acquitted of murder after he claimed he killed Black in self-defense while trying to wrestle a gun away from him.